Hello, it's Miss Julie from Miss Julie's Virtual Preschool and Crafts. I'm here to do a story time for you today. But before we get started, hit that subscribe button below so you can see when I go live and when I put out new videos just for you. Now, in some parts of the United States and around the world, children are going back to school. And you may have started school or you have a little bit more time of summer left before you go back to school. So I thought I would read a back to school book. What I chose today is Tanya Takes the School Bus. Have you taken the school bus before? Are you gonna ride the school bus this school year? Well, maybe she'll tell you some tips about taking the school bus, but let's see. All right. Back to school, it says. I get to ride the school bus this year. I'm excited and a little nervous. Ooh, they're at the school and it's the kids are all getting their school supply list and where their bus stop is. And it says the bus schedule. Dad took me to back to school night and we learned my bus number and my bus stop. That is very important. So you know where to stand to get your bus and where what number bus you ride on. My bus driver, Anne, taught me how to stay safe near the bus. Okay, there's the bus safety, it says. Oh, I learned that I cannot see the driver. She cannot see me. Oh, so look, it says the crossing arm in front of the bus shows how far to stay away from the school bus. That's very important. So you don't walk too close to the bus. So you only are gonna walk to the door and back onto the sidewalk. what else you learn about the bus? The bus stop. On the first day of school, Dad and I go to the bus stop a little early. I don't want to miss the bus. There we go. You're going to walk with an adult to the bus stop. We stay off the street and away from traffic. We stay safe while we wait for the bus. When the bus comes, we step back from the curb and wait for the stop sign and the lights flash red. I know flashing lights mean that cars behind the bus must stop. And the bus driver taught us that. And opens the door and says, good morning, all aboard. When we get on the bus one at a time, I hold the railing and walk up the steps. On the bus, I hear my friend Zoe call my name to save me a seat on the bus. We talk quietly so we don't bother the bus driver. At the next stop, Marco gets on the bus and uses the lift door to help Marco on the bus. I wave at Marco and say hello. Then we are at school. We stay in our seats until the bus stops. Here we are, Suzanne. Have a great day at school. Um, the school day is done. We line up outside and a teacher checks us to make sure we get onto the right bus. I can see my dad waiting for me at the bus stop when we get to my neighborhood. Today was a great day. I can't wait to ride on the bus tomorrow. Did you enjoy that story? Well, I hope you did. And I hope you learned a few things about riding the school bus, especially if you've never done it before and it's new to you this school year. So you remember to follow the rules on the bus and you'll stay safe getting to school and getting home. Why don't you come back next time to another story or craft from Miss Julie's virtual preschool and crafts. Thanks.